Good morning, everyone. I'm Helen from Georgia, and I'm out here on this beautiful morning. Oh, there's a big old bird. Oh, my goodness. Oh, if that camera had been a little higher, he was... He's out there eating fish out of my pond. The water's not very deep. It's so dry here that... Uh, all the water's going up in the trees or whatever. It's supposed to be going down, but it's so dry. We haven't had any rain in a while now. I don't know when. Oh, y'all, this is your coffee this morning. I'm going to let you drink out of my cup. This is it. See, y'all's coffee is steaming, too. Don't sip it too fast because it'll burn you. <laughs> I'm going to try not to burn myself with mine. And I'm drinking out of my Redbird cup. That's a giant cup. That's a big old cup. I love it. It's, there's that bird again. Flying all over everywhere. Uh, Y'all, this is my flowers again. There's another one. Lord, how many is out there? Oh, here's another one. I guess they're leaving. I don't know. But anyway, did I... it looks like rain, but they're not calling for rain. So I don't guess it's going to rain, but it's cloudy looking. And that's nice because it's not real hot, but I know winter's coming and it's going to be cold. And I'm going to be cold. Oh, and I was telling you about my flowers. Uh, I'm having a time trying to find some flowers. This is my butterfly bush. It's still blooming. I still have butterflies everywhere. This is my golden rods. And this is zinnias. Uh, someone said golden rods bother them, like, with allergies and stuff. They don't bother me at all. I don't have allergies, I don't guess. I, I've never been bothered with. There goes another one of them birds. Oh my goodness, maybe they'll leave. They won't come back <laughs> and eat my fish. I guess they gotta eat something though, don't they? <laughs> I don't know what those kind of birds eat. They are big old, big old birds with big old wings way, way wide, and they're black and white, and they got long legs where they can walk around in water. And I went out there the other day, and I bet there was 25 out there around my pond. But anyway, I'm out here on this beautiful cooler morning and I and I see right now it's gonna be cold for long and I I don't do well in cold weather I I don't do well in real real hot weather either but, and you gotta have both of them but this summer has been very very hot and dry and it's just just what we got this this year and and that's all there are to it you can't help it you just got to deal with it and go on and do what you can do and uh, try to make the best of it you can and y'all I'm uh, I've been trying to figure out a project to do and I've, I've thought of one that I'm going to try that I've never done and don't know. Well, I never know what it's going to do, but I'm going to try to do something uh, today with uh I came out here, and there was an old flower pot, a terracotta flower pot, one of them old red pots. Well, it had a plant in it, but the plant was about dead. So I took the plant out and put it in another pot in case it wanted to live. <laughs> uh, I took it 
in the house. It was early this morning. It was early. It was before daylight. <laughs> uh, I took it in the house, and I it was all green and had dirt in it and everything. You know, I, I, it was just a mess, really. But I took it in the house, and I put it in the a pan in there, and I washed it. I put, took a steel wool, and I washed all that stuff off. Tried to get it off, but it didn't all come off. But I'm going to show it to you. Let me have another sip of coffee. Did I tell y'all to come on up here close where y'all can see and hear? <laughs> so you won't have to, so you won't have to strain your ears to hear me cuz I don't I, I know you don't want to miss nothing. <laughs> y'all, if y'all miss something, it won't it, it won't hurt nothing. I, I it, it it don't don't worry. Uh it'll be okay. But I just wanted to make y'all feel welcome and come on in and thank y'all for my viewers that are so faithful. I got 88,000 subscribers! Y'all, oh, yay! I'm so thankful. Thank the Lord. I am so blessed to have that many subscribers and it's just amazing. It's just been a roller coaster just ride for me. And I'm just so thankful and so blessed to have all that. And and I'm I'm wanting to get a hundred thousand. <laughs> but I don't know when that'll be, but whenever it is, if it ever is, uh I'll be I'll be thankful really then. Because I I I haven't been doing this like about two and a half years and I think that's pretty good for somebody that didn't know nothing about this stuff at all I, all of this is new to me all of it well anyway I was going to show y'all what I was going to do let me move this coffee cup I don't want to put it too far over because I don't want it falling off. Okay, here's the pot. I got it sitting on a paper plate so it won't scratch this table. But this is the pot. And I don't really know how old this pot is, but it's old. It's It's got... See, I didn't get all the green old stuff off of it. I couldn't get it all off. It wouldn't come off. So, I'm going to leave it on there. I'm going to cover it up. I'm going to... I'm going to put some seed glass and stained glass and all that. I'm going to put something on it. To, and it won't show this pot. <laughs> but, you know, I, I love this pot. I love a, a terracotta pots, but... I want this old pot to look better. I want it. I'm going to put some flowers on it, and I'm going to put some leaves on it, and I am and I don't really know what all I am going to put on it, but I'm going to put something on it. And it's going to be beautiful, I hope. That's what I'm planning on doing. It's a pretty big pot. Let me show you all the inside of it. It's still a little little dirty on the inside, but it doesn't matter. Uh, it's a good pot. It's not uh, falling apart or anything like, you know, it's, it's good and steady and it's not about to anything happen to it. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be like full of flowers and some leaves are... Whatever, I I really and truly, I just come up with this this morning. <laughs> so, I'm going, I'm going to do as I go along, and when I figure out what I'm going to do and how I'm going to do, I'll let y'all know. <laughs> Is that fair or not? I don't really know. I can't tell you because when you don't know yourself, you can't really tell somebody that you're going to do something that you don't know what you're going to do. 
Y'all look at this breeze blowing. And where are my birds? I don't know. But I hear one. I hear a bird, but I don't see one. All I've seen is them big old I don't know what those birds are called. They big old big old birds. They they got big old wings that go <laughs> this way big. They they go across there and they they're big old birds. Anyway, y'all, I'm gonna get my sea glass out and my stained glass and my uh glass that I broke and bought, you know, I buy uh, little uh, vases and little things that's colored, and I break them and I cut them up, and I use them on things that I, like this table here. I cut up stuff and put it on this table, and that's what I'm going to sort of do with this, but I don't know I can't tell y'all how it's going to look because I don't know yet. When I find it, well, y'all will see when I see. I'll see the same time y'all are. <laughs> I, I won't, uh, I don't know. But it's going to be, I think it's going to be really pretty. I, 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 I'm excited about, let me get my coffee. It's way over here. And this is a pretty good sized pot and it's going to, take some tiles and stuff and I hope I have enough that 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 will show and, and look good on here but we'll see about that when it happens uh, that's all I can say is when it, when I get it done I'll, I'll let y'all see it and I'm gonna get up here now and get my uh, my glass and all that stuff out and sort it out and see what I'm going to use and I'm going to get back with you in a few minutes or a little bit later when I get all my stuff together but I'll see y'all y'all and y'all please y'all keep watching my videos uh y'all share and subscribe and click the bell and thumbs up and all that y'all do so so sweet Y'all, if y'all don't mind, do that. And if you know somebody that likes things like this or might might like to try something that they never have before, just get something out. I, I, I think everyone has terracotta flower pots. Uh, I've had them all my life, but, you know, I've never thought about decorating one. But I've decided to try it, and that's what I'm going to do. And We're going to see how it looks. Y'all don't go away. I'll be back for sure. And have a sip of coffee on me. Here's, here's to y'all. <laughs> my faithful subscribers and my YouTube family. Okay. I'm going to turn it off right now, and I'll be back. Y'all, I'm back, and the sun has come out. I didn't think it was going to come out today, but it did. Uh, I'm, I'm thinking <laughs> this might be a big job. Y'all, I've never done this before, but you can do a little bit at the time. Okay, I've got some pieces cut out here that I'm going to uh, try to stick down. I need some more glue, I think, on, on more parts of it.
Y'all, when you <laughs> when you never done this before, you don't really know what you're getting into. You don't know what kind of uh, problems you're gonna find. I need this glue to come out better than it's doing because it's hard to get out. this on here. Now see. Y'all my camera cut off and I I've, I've just been out here trying to get some of these pieces uh, on here and I think I'm gonna put some of these things right up here. I got to uh, cut some more yellow ones. I haven't stuck them on here yet, but I've... And it's hard to see in here. It's like dark. <laughs> I'm just... I'm just going along. I don't really uh, exactly have a plan. Exactly. <laughs> I was going to put some flowers on here, and I got some flowers on here, but it's not, you know, I'm not going to, this is not all I'm going to do. And I don't know if this is going to stick and hold or not. y'all can't probably see because I can't see myself. <sighs> Too good. You know, <laughs> you never really know how anything is until you try it yourself. You don't, you don't know what uh, pops up that you don't know what to do about. And but 
But it's going to be what it's going to be, so. Uh, that's all I know. And again, you know, it's it's time consuming, like cutting your pieces and all that. And I, I tried to cut some before, but it seemed like I never cut enough that, of what I need. I cannot see. It is dark in here. Y'all, I didn't think this was going to be all that difficult, you know. I thought it was going to seem like I can figure out a way to have a little difficulty with it. nice and cool out here. A breeze is blowing and good morning everyone. I'm Helen from Georgia and I'm back out here this morning trying to do some more stuff to this uh, pot. Y'all, I, I took it in the house last night, and I worked on it a little more, and there's a glare on it. I can't hardly see. I don't know where I need to get to be able to see what I'm doing. Uh, this is how much I've got done on it. Are y'all having coffee this morning? Oh, uh, I'm trying to. I'm, <laughs> I'm having the time trying to get my stuff together, trying to get it organized and see what I'm going to do next. Y'all, it's like impossible to figure it out. What to do next and where to put it and all that stuff. I'm going to be knock my coffee cup over. Uh, Y'all know this is going to be a flower pot with flowers. Well, it's going, I'm going to fill in, but anywhere there's a space that like needs a flower, I'm going to put a flower there. If it's possible. I'm telling you, I'm... I, I, I'm picking some pretty strenuous projects to, and I don't know that they're going to be like this till I start them. I, I don't, uh, y'all, I'm, I'm just trying to figure out what to do and where to do it, and all that stuff. And I want to ask y'all a question. Do y'all ever have times when you can't sleep, you wake up in the middle of the night and it's too early to get up, but you can't lay there in, I can't, I can't lay in the bed. If I'm not asleep, I'm, I'm ready to get up. And I, tr I lay there and lay there and try to get sleepy so I can go back to sleep. But sometimes it's just impossible to do that and I get up, then I'm give out. Like yesterday, I was exhausted. I, I did not, wasn't functioning 100%, I don't think. But, 
No. I hope I'm not the only person like that. that I don't know if that's normal or where it's not normal, but apparently it it happens a lot when when I'm when the time changes and everything. But the time hasn't changed yet. But it's still. I, I'm I'm just uh, not a sleeping person that much, y'all. I, I am. I'm a disaster. <laughs> I can't. I can't get going and can't decide. I know y'all not like that. I'm trying to figure out where to put things, and and that's not easy, y'all. I'm trying to. When you when you don't have it figured out already and know what you're gonna do, it's kinda hard to make that decision. And I'm gonna put like something in all these empty spots. I'm gonna put something. But I was, let me, I was going, and my hand is sore from clipping glass. I, I tried to do some of that where uh, it won't. I was going to put some down here, but I don't think I have enough room. I think I'll put it up here. Maybe, maybe I can find room up here. I'll put something else down there. Oh, y'all, I need some help. <laughs> This mosaic stuff is pretty rough on my little brain that I got up there. Trying to figure out where to put things and wh what color to put and all that stuff. need to put that color down there. I think that's what I'm supposed to do. Okay, let me, I've decided that now. Let me see if I, if I can find them and see if I can get them down there. But y'all know what? <laughs> It's still fun to get out here and try to decide what you want and where you want it and how you're going to put it there. And my glue keeps stopping up. And I'm thankful that it does because if it didn't, uh, I would be having to buy more glue. Oh, there's some. I'm going to kind of lean it over and stick some of this. Where's my stuff? And y'all, there's a breeze blowing. There. 
that's hitting my cup over here. And I don't want my cup on the ground like I have had. Y'all, I, I wish they was a faster way than this, but I guess they're not. I'm going to try to, I don't even know if y'all can see because I, I've got my arm in the way. Can't hold to these little things. They keep sliding out of my hand. And y'all, oh, I haven't told y'all what temperature what it is. It's 65 degrees. It's a lot, lot cooler than it has been. It's a lot cooler. And that's great, but, and I like it. But I know winter's coming. And winter is a lot of wind and a lot of cold weather. Not my favorite. And I, I guess I did complain a little bit about the summer, but I try not to. Because I can usually tolerate the summer pretty good. I, but this summer has been so very, very hot and dry and You know, I, I don't, I don't like to complain about any of it, but really, but I, in the summer, you, you had to get up so early and get out here, and, and the sun would be right here where I am, just blazing down on me hot, and, and you can't hardly work with the heat so bad on you. But it, we're gonna have that if we live and and I'm so happy that I'm living and I'm I'm doing good and I'm other than <laughs> I can't get things done as fast as I would like to but you know I guess when you get older you're gonna slow down and I've never been the fastest person in the world anyway I I really well I'm deciding what like this stuff Kelly, you have to, I have to please myself, and, and I want to put something where I think it will look good, and And I want it the best that it can be, if it's possible. You know, the Lord's beauty is just awesome to look what He has done for us and what He's put here for us to enjoy and be, have joy looking and being in such a beautiful place with all this that he gives us and I want to enjoy it 
the cost. I mean, he gave it to us, and some people don't like outdoors at, like I do. Like, and squeezing this glue and squeezing and squeezing uh get, your hands get tired I don't see my bird y'all what they're doing and someone told me that I needed to take my hummingbird food down and I usually do that I I've let it go longer this year than I've ever let it I think but I'm gonna take it down because you know they they need to go and and I don't know if I'm holding them back, you know, letting them have food but, so they don't want to leave. I want them to do what nature tells them to do. And I'm going, I'm going to take it down. I think they're about all gone anyway, but there's a straggler or two around, and I don't want to. keep them from doing what they need to do. Usually you can't stop nature because they know they have they have a sensor or something that tells them <laughs> when to go and and I believe they go. But I certainly don't want to keep them when they need to go. This stuff, I've been, you know, I, I, I tried to put out a video a week and that is pretty, good job to do that and to, it's, and I edit and I do all the everything I edit all my videos I take all my videos and I, I uh, have to get all my things out and put all my things back up I have have them in little tubs and I have to go through them and get what I think I'm gonna need and And I'm not complaining, y'all. I'm just telling y'all that it's kind of a lot. Because one week goes by so fast. <laughs> then here's another week. And and I, 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 I'm trying to think up a, a video that would... be good to put on that y'all would enjoy and I would enjoy doing and that I could do because I don't know you know if I can uh, you know I'm not a professional at all try to do what I can do
And I'm so amazed that that I am able to do a pretty good bit of this. Let me have a sip of coffee. I've been talking too much. Okay, I got them. I don't know about right here. I'm not sure about them. Okay, I'm still working on my pot. I put this little blue flower on here while I was, to see how it was going to look. Okay, I'm going to, now I'm going to put a, I hope y'all can see better than me, because I can't hardly see a thing. As a glare or something, uh, y'all. If you don't have patience, this is not the thing for you, <laughs> I don't think, because you have to have patience to figure out where are you going to put this and where are you going to put that. and. Okay, now let me, uh, another blue one. I could put some other colors besides that up there, but I don't know if I want to or not. I think I'm just going to put the two blues up there. Oh, my camera cut off a while ago. I, I guess I told you I don't know. I Sometimes I get to doing stuff and I... I lose contact. <laughs> But isn't it fun to do something like this that is not in your really thinking that you, I didn't even know if this was going to look all right or not. Oh, that's awesome. Y'all, I'm forgetting to drink my coffee. See how you get consumed in what you're doing and you forget? I mentioned an old age does that too. <laughs> I'm still out here uh, working on this pot. I tell y'all what, <laughs> I would not believe that it would take this long to put this on a little flower pot. 
I must be the slowest thing in the world. But I'm 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 thinking and doing as I go and I'm just not planning that much. I'm just I'm just doing. I'm just letting it turn out the way it wants to turn out. <laughs> sort of. I don't want to bore y'all too much with all this that I'm doing because it's just sticking stuff somewhere wherever you can get it. I guess my problem is, if I have a problem, is trying to put, I want a lot of flowers on here. And I'm putting them in every opening that I have, that I see. And then the openings that's left, I'm going to fill it in with some little tiles. It may not uh, be many because I'm filling up this thing with these flowers pretty much. I'm thinking about, I may have to stop. I've been on this thing a pretty good while. I haven't been on the camera that much, but I've been doing this. I didn't want to bore, I mean, I didn't want this, this very, very long uh, video, but it seems like I'm just <laughs> not having any luck with that part. Seems like it's taking so long to do what I do. <laughs> and I'm slow because I'm thinking and I'm, 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 designing as I go if y'all ever heard of such a thing <laughs> I think that's how I like to do I, I mean I think I like to figure out what I'm going to do as I go I don't plan all of it completely. I just, I just sort of start and see how it goes. And, and I want it to be a flower, flower pot. I see my battery flashing. If it ain't one thing, it's another but they do run out, y'all, and I need to order me some more. It's not going to stop till I put a new battery in. When it cuts off, y'all will know it's, it's cut off because it'll stop. And y'all, these are not perfect flowers, I know. But they're the best I can do under the circumstances with what I have. Yes, I run out of room after a while for a flower because I'm pretty much filling, filling it up. Oh, I think it's pretty. <laughs> I think it is, but 
that's not what everybody might think. I, I think uh, everybody has their own opinion about what, what looks good and what doesn't. Okay. Never, ever thought of doing this. Never thought of it. I just, I just sort of thought of it the other day, and I decided, well, I'll try that. May not look the best in the world, but it'll be one of a kind, y'all. <laughs> I hadn't told y'all that. I know there's not another one like this. I know it. I know there's not. There can't be another one like this. All this stuff, good gracious, they ain't nobody could copy this pot. They might put their own techniques to it. It's, it's, uh, it's pretty hard to <laughs> make another one like this. I would hate to have to do it myself. But it's so much fun, y'all, to just get out what you have to work with and see what comes out of all this stuff it's like making a cake sort of and not having a recipe you just you just put something in there and hope it works Yeah, you, uh, you put your stuff in there and you hope when you get finished that it's something pretty. Because you don't ever know what, what's going to work and what doesn't work until you try. And that's what I like to do. I like to see what works. It might be hard, it might be a pretty good bit of work in it, but look what you're going to have when you get finished. Something that you're proud of. And that nobody else has one like it. Nobody. <laughs> Lord, my camera still... It might be about to cut off. Maybe already cut off. I don't know. Oh, is that pretty or what? Good morning. <laughs> Y'all, I thought this little pot would be easy to get through with and, uh, get started on something else gracious it has <laughs> fooled me gracious alive I got all my I got I worked on my flowers so I wouldn't bore y'all to death because and this is probably going to bore y'all too uh, I'm wanting to Fill up all these empty spaces with something, with some of this stuff here. Y'all, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to work on it and let y'all see what I'm doing. And, but I'm not going to make y'all watch the whole thing because it's just too boring to sit and watch me try to find something to fit that place. Gracious, it's about to... I didn't know it was going... Which, I, I really didn't plan exactly how it was going to be to begin with. I just... I was going to make something... But... And I, I didn't really have a... I, I knew some of the things I was going to do, but... Uh, everything you do doesn't... You you don't think... I, I don't. I don't say y'all. <laughs> I'll say me. 
I don't think it through, and, and I don't think you can, because you you don't know what's going to come up that you uh, need a, a piece for there. Okay, there's a piece for that place. I, I don't, I want y'all to see what I'm doing if you want to see, but it's hard for me to see and y'all to see at the same time. See, I put that little piece right in there. I need a tiny little piece right there. And then sometimes when you stick them in there, you can't get them back out. Y'all, I have a deep appreciation for uh, people that work on mosaic stuff. <laughs> because, oh my goodness. And you, and you put it up here and you try it and it fits then you can't get it back out and you're not gonna know if it fits unless you stick it in there to find out and I'm just trying to find some places to put some stuff do y'all know that I have come out here and brought my coffee and set it over here and forgot about it. Let me drink some of it, being, being I remembered I had it. I'm gonna see if I can get around here where I can see. Adding up when you old and can't see, but one day I, w I won't be able. I'll, I'll have good eyes and I can see everything. And won't that be awesome? I won't have to worry about all that stuff. Can't hear real good. <laughs> uh, I worked in a factory that. was loud, very loud, and it affects your hearing after after years of doing that, it, it will affect your hearing. We, we had to wear earplugs because it was loud. Back then, you didn't realize that one day, you would uh, lose some of your hearing. Y'all, my camera cut off. And I kept working and putting little things in every spot that I could find. Now, I'm going to try to fix this part up here. Y'all, I have got to sit down. I was standing up here working on this and I looked down and there was a snake crawling across my foot. Ah, I like to die. I couldn't move because he was on my foot. It took him a while to get all the way across it. Uh, Lord have mercy. I never had that happen to me before. He's in that flower bed right over there. Uh, oh my goodness. And I got these shoes on this that this open. And I just slide your foot in there and that snake. I looked down, I didn't feel a thing. I didn't feel nothing. I just looked down, I saw something black and it was going across my foot. Oh, I am faint feeling. <laughs> oh, God, leave me. Lord help. I'm trying to do this project and I'm having the time and I'm. This just about 
wipe me out, y'all. Cody's in the house. He's not working, but he don't. He he's in his bedroom doing something. I don't know what he's doing, but. Lord have mercy. I'll be looking down all the time now seeing if there's a snake crawling across my foot. Oh. I don't know where he went, but he might be still over there. I don't know. I'm not looking for him because I don't want to see him. <clears throat> I was, I was standing up over here doing something, get, uh, cutting some little pieces or something other, and I didn't feel that snake on my foot. It was like nothing. I just happened to look down, and there's a black. It was a big old snake. He was long too. It took a while for him to get off my foot, and I couldn't move till he left. Oh. I about got the headache. Now I got to worry about snakes out here. I got to worry about snakes in the house. I got to worry about snakes out here. I... Lord have mercy. What next? Mm. Oh gracious, what the... Oh, oh Lord have mercy. I think I was, I don't even know what I was doing. I think I was trying to get some pieces to go up here. I'm shaking all over. Good gracious, I heard something over there. I don't think it's that snake. I don't think it could make all that noise. I think the wind's blowing. Now I'm nervous. I'm shaking and I'm... never thought a snake would come up here where I'm at and crawl across my foot. Could have been a rattlesnake, I guess, but it wasn't a rattlesnake. It was a black snake. Oh. Oh. That scared me half to death. Or all, almost all the way to death. <laughs> That's the first time I've ever had a snake crawl across my foot. Whew. I probably need to have some, some better shoes on. I'm gonna have that problem. I need to get me some boots. That wasn't that king snake. I don't know. I, I think it was just a, a black snake. Oh, that'll scare you. I can't even, I'm breathing hard. I'll be looking everywhere for that thing to come, up, come back. He might come back across here. Oh, good gracious. I've had chickens and rabbits and Snake's in the house, in Cody's room. That, that is scary. I, I don't, I don't like 
one coming up here this close and crawling across my foot. And y'all, let me sit down a minute. I, I'm fainty feeling. I really am. I, I'm... That just... I was so scared, I couldn't even holler. I just, I just stood there, was hoping he'd get on across my foot and go on. Oh, my goodness. I'm going to uh, cut the camera off and go in the house and sit down and rest and calm down. Y'all, I'm sorry. I, I, I just got to calm down a little bit because I'm, I'm nervous. I'll be back after I calm down some. Bye-bye. I'm back out here. Really, I, I am nervous as I can be, and I'm looking for snakes everywhere. I, I've never had a snake on me, on my foot, or nothing. The worst thing I've ever had is that snake in Cody's bedroom that other day. That like, But that was a small one. That one was about this, let's see where y'all at, about this long. This one was long. I was standing here, think, uh, I think I was getting a piece of that stuff. I didn't have my camera on because it was taking so long to do what I was doing. And I, I just... I was kind of looking down and I saw something black and I looked and that snake was going across my foot. Oh, I was, I couldn't even scream. I, I was just petrified. I, I just stood there and just praying he would get on over and how much more longer before he got across my foot. Oh. Seemed like it took five minutes for him to get his whole body off my foot. Oh, I was about to die. And I'm still about to die. <laughs> oh, I can't hardly sit out here. Uh, thinking about another one may come across here. That's the first time I have ever had that. And I hope it's the last. Good gracious, I didn't was n not even nothing about dreaming about a snake coming across my foot like that one did. And I mean, he was taking his time. He wasn't rushing at all. If I'd have screamed, he might have rushed. I don't know, but I couldn't even scream. I was too, I was too uh, scared. I couldn't uh, move. And I'm still kind of breathless or something, another. Just, I, I don't know. Might take me a while to get over that. I mean, I'm okay with snakes as long as I can see them and they are out yonder. <laughs> but when they come up here where I'm at and, and, and they on my foot, now that's another story. That is another completely story. Oh. oh, gracious. I just don't know. What else? I'm trying my best to get through with this flower pot. I didn't think this would be nothing. Well, I did. I thought it was might be, might take a little time, but I did not think it would take this long because 
It took me a long time on that table. But this is like, I don't know, it's, this is a pretty good size pot, but I still didn't think it was going to take this long. But again, I know why it, took, it takes this long. Because I'm, I'm looking for pieces that will fit in a certain place. And, and you don't just find that piece. You have to cut that piece. You have to uh, cut a piece for, for that place, that shape that you're needing. And y'all are not going to have to watch all of that because I'll, uh, I'll shorten it if I can. And so y'all won't have to see the entire thing that I'm trying to do with all this cutting and stuff. Oh, Lord, y'all, I'm still weak as... Oh, I went in there and eat uh, a piece of cheese toast. Thought that would calm me down a little, but I'm still shaking. I'm still like all the pieces <laughs> if y'all know what all the pieces is oh my goodness Whew. it's just a little bit uh more that i bargained for I, I i really wasn't expecting no snake out here now, one could have crawled over there, and that would have scared me a little bit for him being that close, but when they crawl across your foot, you know, that's, that's something else. Something completely else. Now, I've got a big king snake that lives out there in a hole. I know where the hole is, uh, but I don't bother him. He doesn't bother me. He just, I see him every now and then uh, going across the yard or something, but this, this here on a big old I don't know how long that thing was. I thought he would never get across my foot because I thought he kept coming and kept coming. I was looking. Where, how long is this thing? shaking sometime today I might not I like to never got over that little that little old snake that was in Cody's room I kept thinking that thing could come in my room and, and get up here on the bed and I'd have a fit if, if I, I, I looked I turned the light on before I walk in the room uh, a dark room because I, I ain't want no snake to be in there. And it could be. You, know, you don't ever know where a snake is. You sure don't know that one could crawl across your foot. Still pretty shaky over that, and I know he, he probably wouldn't kill me if he bit me, but 
I don't guess he would. I'd probably kill myself trying to get away. I'd probably kill myself trying to run or whatever, get getting somewhere away from that thing. Cause I don't, I, 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 I'm not no snake person. They was some, some, somebody in our church one time had a pet python and they had it in a cage and they went in there one day to see about it or something other and that thing was gone I could oh my goodness and they never found that snake either I don't oh gracious I know that snake Cody uh, got out of that room. I know that snake was out of there because Cody carried him out and put him back on there. But these people didn't know where that snake was at. They they didn't know if he was if he had got out or if he was still in there or what. But they still live in that house and <laughs> I guess I guess the snake got out, I don't know. Because snakes have to eat. And I don't know if a snake could find enough in your house to survive or not. But I I keep a little light on in my house because I don't I want to be able to see if somebody comes in there. I want to see them if uh, if they're in there. I want to uh, without having to get up and turn the light on. I want to see where they are if there's somebody in there. Let's 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 not talk about snakes anymore. <laughs> oh, this snake deal is about to unnerve me again. I'll be, I never dreamed there would be a snake right here crawling across my foot. This is my peaceful place right here. I wanted to be peaceful, not a snakey. But, I don't know. You don't get everything you want. You, 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 you get what you, what you're given. I guess. What you, I don't know what they're doing. I don't know if they're looking. It was cool this morning. Like, you know, I don't know if they're looking for somewhere to, uh, Hibernate. That one that that one that lives in the yard. He he's got a there's some holes all around in my yard and I watched him one day. He went in a hole and I know exactly where that hole is. But I don't mess with that hole and he don't mess with me and that's a good deal. We we uh he can kill snakes or whatever he wants to do they say they kill rattlesnakes I don't know but that's okay with me you know if he wants to kill a rattlesnake that's that's okay with me I just I just want to I don't want to have to deal with them crawling around me if they weigh out yonder I can I can deal with that. I mean, if I see a snake. When I first started this video a few days ago, they was 
some big old birds. I guess they're migrating birds, because I don't think those birds stay around here. Those big old birds that was in my pond, uh, I think, I think those birds were migrating. I, but they're still here. They're still around here, but I think they're going somewhere, some other place. They're not going to stay here. They, I think they're, you know how birds, like the hummingbirds, I haven't seen a hummingbird, but I took their feet up, so I guess I won't see them. Maybe they'll go on and go wherever they go. And, Okay, y'all, my camera cut off while I was talking. I don't even remember what I was talking about. Oh, I think I I don't know how, when it cut off. If, if I'm not really looking at it uh, right then, then I don't know exactly where it cut off. But anyway, Cody, Cody's in there now. I went in there and told him about the snake. He said, Grandma, that snake wasn't going to hurt you. It, it's not a, a venomous snake. I, I, I know that, but that don't stop you, a snake crawling across your foot. And I'm scared, I, I mean, I, you know, like I said, I'm not scared of them if they're crawling out yonder. But when one comes right up here where I'm at and crawls across my foot, and I'm so scared I can't even move or holler or nothing, just having to wait for it to get all the way across my foot, Seemed like five minutes. But anyway, I think I was telling y'all, I don't need, so much is going on, y'all. I haven't, I haven't told y'all to please subscribe and share and click the bell and thumbs up and all that sweet, kind stuff y'all do for me that helps me up helps me out and and I'm through with my I'm through putting all this stuff on here and I'm going uh, I'm going to uh, mix up my resin and come out here and paint it. I'm, I'm just going to paint it on uh, I think this is just beautiful I think it's absolutely beautiful, which I think I need a lot. But it's it's about covered. It I covered by every millimeter of it. <laughs> I, ever, I, I don't even know what a millimeter is, but I I covered all all on there that I could. And I just think it's beautiful. I've never seen one like it, have y'all? I've never seen one like this. I just decided to try one and I found this pot and Okay, I'm going I'm gonna go in there now. See if I can get my uh, resin together, and I'm going to paint it on and let it dry. And that'll be tomorrow sometime before it gets dry, if I do it now. Y'all, I'm back. I I went in the house and uh, told Cody about the snake. <laughs> he acts like, you know, there's nothing to worry about, but it is something. Anyway... He mixed up my resin for me, and you mix half and half, and you stir it and stir it and stir it. I don't know how long. Uh, just read on the box. Cody fixed it, and I, I didn't do it. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm wanting to get through with this. I'm going to put it in this tray here. Uh, it won't run out. If any runs out, I can... Get it, get it up with this wax paper. Okay, I'm gonna put my pot in here, and I guess I'll put it 
back on this turntable. I can find somewhere to pick it up without hurting it. Okay, now I'm going to put it back on here. That way I can take it in the house if I need to. I can pick it up with this little... Uh, Pray that it's sitting in. Okay. Okay. Here's my... I'm going to brush it on with this brush. I might need to take it in the house because my birds are so nosy. They'll probably come jump in here and see what I'm doing. Y'all don't know it, but they, they are very inquisitive about my stuff. They kind of stay off at a distance, but if I go in the house... Okay, y'all, this is, this is finished. It's, it's complete. I'm through with it, uh, all but letting it dry. And thank y'all so much for being so patient and kind and watching and uh, sharing uh, my videos and all the kind things you do. Okay, y'all, I'm going to stop. Y'all have a blessed, blessed rest of the day and night. And y'all be kind to each other and uh, be a blessing to someone each day. And uh, enjoy your life and yourself because... You have to create your own joy most of the time. <laughs> if there's no joy around, you make some. And that's what I try to do because everybody's not joyful and happy. Every, uh, some, some people choose to uh, be sad, and I, tr I try not to choose that. And sometimes we are, and sometimes uh, situations come up, but, you know, you, you just have to uh, see that that's not going to stay forever. That's going to be a passing thing. That's not going to uh, make you sad always. It's going to get better. And 
make something that is beautiful and that you like and and maybe some other people will like it you know I don't know I don't know how many people like this kind of stuff but I do I've never I didn't know that uh, this kind of stuff even existed I, I I've just I've never been arts and crafts stuff at, at all I and I never watched YouTube uh, that uh, that much you know I've, I've just recently I watch a lot of different people doing a lot of different things that it looks fun just make your own whatever you think of that you can do that you can do that will make you happy and make other people happy that's what you should do and okay well I'm going I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow or uh, sometime when this gets dry and we'll see how it looks then y'all have a blessed blessed day subscribe and share and everything and y'all have a cup of coffee on me i've got some over there <laughs> y'all I, I i get busy and i forget to drink my coffee is that is that normal y'all <laughs> y'all i don't know if i'm normal or not I get to working and get to doing something, and that snake just took everything. I, was, I mean, I, I didn't, I, I, I've not been the same since. But I got resin on my hands, so I'm going to pick up this cup with my, my, my napkin so I won't get resin on it. It's cold. But it's still good. Tastes like coffee. <laughs> okay. Bye-bye. Good morning, everyone. Is everyone having a good morning? I'm Helen from Georgia. And I guess y'all know who I am. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, I'm telling y'all, if you just come in on this last part of this video i'm helen from georgia and i'm out here showing you my finished project let me move this oh uh, this is it y'all <laughs> this this was more than i thought i'll say that <laughs> It was more than I thought, but how beautiful it turned out. Oh, I'm so proud of it. Put flowers on it everywhere that I could. Some of them got kind of covered up. That's a flower, and 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 that. Oh, it's just flowers all over. It's, it's just a flower, flower pot, <laughs> I'll say. Uh... Y'all, I had to run to town this morning to uh, check the post office because they closed at 12. And I had to run up there. And I went into a little store over there uh, in my little town that it's a family a store, like, you know, sells cheaper things. And I was in there looking around and just uh, got a few little things. And as I was checking out, this man came in and he looked uncared for very bad. His hair was like needed washing and his clothes needed washing too. And he asked the cashier where the VCs were. It's a form of something for a headache. And she checked me out and he patiently stood there and waited on her. And I just felt that that man needed something extra today. 
and I, I I paid for my things and I and the lady bagged them up and put them in my buggy and she and he was paying for his BCs for a headache or feeling bad or whatever it was. I, uh, the Lord just spoke to me and I felt in my heart that that man needed a kind word and I gave him some money and he thanked me and told me God blessed me and I feel that God did bless me because some people are down and can't get up You know, a kind word from a stranger. He doesn't know who I am, and I don't know who he was. But it gives people faith in people that may not have any at that time in their life. So I, I, I just, I felt like, it, you know, I don't know what he was going to do with the money, but I, I felt the Lord uh, led me to do a kind deed for someone, and I did. So whatever he do, does with the money is between him and God. I I gave from my heart, and I, I feel good about it. I hate that people are in that shape and in, in that way in their life I, I'm I pray for homeless people and because my son once told me that there was a lot of homeless people in this town that sleep in the woods and I never forgot it you know he 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 was kind of down to himself you know but I always pray for those people that are homeless because it must be terrible not to have a home to get go in and close the door and get in your warm bed and thank the Lord for a warm bed and a roof over your head and all the people that care about you. Some people feel that no one cares and people do care. The Lord cares. The Lord loves everyone, no matter what. He loves every single person. And He wants them to do good. And maybe they will one day. If somebody helps them out and gives them a little lift in their life, maybe, maybe they can. Well, I got off my subject a little bit, but I just wanted to tell y'all what happened this morning. On top of this snake deal yesterday, this snake like killed me. Didn't even bite me, but he went across my foot and, and I looked down and that thing looked like a monster. <laughs> and he was a bigger, a, a big snake. He wasn't no little tiny one like was in Cody's room. It was, it was a big old long snake. It took him a while to go on across my foot. He wasn't in no hurry either. He wasn't hurrying at all. And I was frozen, and I was just frozen with fear. I couldn't say nothing. I couldn't do nothing. I was just so proud when I saw his little tail go across and going in them bushes over there. Whew. Oh, gracious. I'm, so I'm surprised I didn't have nightmares last night about that snake. But I always try to look and see where... See if there's anything laying around that I can see. I don't look under the beds or anything, because... I, I don't go to that link, but I, I'm, I, I'm, I want to look around where I step because a, a lot of times I've just got my, I, I'm barefooted. I don't wear any shoes in the house sometimes. I Sometimes I wear socks, them little slip-on things that you put on your feet. But, uh, oh. I, I'm, I've got on a pair of shoes today that's covered over and my foot ain't sticking out the bottom. The, them shoes I had on yesterday were like little uh, little things that go across the top and your toes is out and the back of it's out. 
and that snake was it would have been bad if I'd have had all shoes all over my foot but I didn't and I've been looking for that thing too I, 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 I've been trying to see if he was going to come out again and go back that way where he come from. But I hope he, if he did, he did while I wasn't out here because I don't want no more snakes crawling across my foot. But anyway, y'all, is this not beautiful? It is so pretty. Make something pretty out of something old. Don't y'all think so? <laughs> I think so. Uh, just because you're old don't mean you're useless and you can't be fixed. So, y'all keep that in mind when you get old. <laughs> okay, y'all. This is my finished project. And I'm so happy with it. Let me drink a little bit of coffee. I'm, I'm, I get off on that snake and I, I really... I, I'm going to be looking for him for a while now. I mean, maybe maybe in the winter he'll go in a hole and stay in there the whole winter. Okay. Uh, y'all, if y'all got a terracotta old pot, or I guess any pot will do, I don't know. Uh, I just, I just like this, this, this size of, and I just had these uh, stones that I have had for a while, and and I wanted to do something with them, and I I wanted to do something with this pot, so I used some of these things that I had on hand. Uh, and it's it is so pretty. I'm so proud of it, y'all. I'm so proud of it. Well, thank y'all so so much for watching this video. And putting up with me, getting off on subjects that I get on sometimes when I'm just talking. And uh, but I'm so blessed to have so many YouTube people that love my videos and that uh, subscribe and they share and they. tell their friends about me and and I just hope so, uh, someone else will get an idea and and try some stuff like this it's very rewarding to do something uh, like this you know to me I didn't think I could do this which I never have you know but uh, you don't ever know what you can do until you do it. You don't know. You don't know what what kind of creations you can make when you when you think about it and you just get your thoughts together and wonder. And a lot of times I have a, an idea like this part. I had an idea that, that I wanted to put flowers all over it and I wanted to fill it in with with this sea glass and mosaic glass it's got both of them in it's got everything that i could find in it so uh i'm just so thankful that that it turned out so good and and i want to tell y'all to try some of this uh some of this stuff that i try it's not that hard or, or i couldn't probably do it <laughs> but I'll see y'all in the next video. Keep watching and don't go away. And I, I love y'all. And, and be a blessing to someone each day. Like bless someone. It feels good when you bless others. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.